So this is a video that I've been super excited to show, but I decided I'm going to split it up into two different parts. I'm going to have a photographic tour, and then I'm also going to have a video tour. And this first one, because it will just be a photographic tour, I decided not to narrate it and just let you enjoy it without me babbling through the entire thing. But first, I want to do a quick setup just so I can tell you how I ended up on board the Anderson that day. I'll try to make this a quick story. And it basically starts with me stalking the Anderson nonstop for the last couple of years. I just go onto the internet, look up its location, find out where the next destination is going to be, and if it passes by Drummond Island, I always run down to the ferry docks with my drone and my camera and see what kind of photographs that I can take. But one day I got one heck of a surprise, and I found out that the destination was actually Drummond Island. In all of my years, I've never actually seen the Anderson dock here at the quarry. So that morning I got all set up. I'm standing about 100 yards from the Anderson, and I'm flying my drone around. And because we're right next to the ferry docks, there's usually a few people hanging around just watching the freighters go through and things like that. And I had somebody standing nearby watching me fly the drone. A couple of minutes later, a couple of gentlemen come walking down from the area of the quarry. I didn't think anything of it. The person that was standing near me decided to go over and talk to them. After a couple of minutes, we found out that they're actually crew from the Anderson. I thought that was really cool. And after talking to them for a little bit longer, we found out that not only were they crew, but they were the first mate and the captain. I couldn't believe it. We are actually standing there talking to the captain of the Anderson. And it was more of a joke, but we asked if we could go on board for a tour. There's no way we ever thought that they would say yes. As soon as we asked, the captain looked down at his watch. He looked back up and he says, five o'clock sound good? I was floored. I couldn't believe it. We actually just got invited on board the Arthur M. Anderson. So join me now as we explore the Arthur M. Anderson together through the lens of my camera. And be sure to stick around to the end because I did leave you with a couple of teasers in what's going to be in the next video version. So thank you for joining me on this incredible journey, and I really hope to see you on the next one.
you kidding me? So we were just up top.